Princess of Wales, Catherine is known for her sense of style, and there's often subtle symbolism behind her outfits. Case in point, the dress she wore a long red dress from Eula London, on six days of the royal tour of India and Pekin with Prince William. Beulah London's co-founder, Natasha Rufus Isaacs, told the princess is a fantastic British ambassador, and they were delighted she chose Bula on this occasion. Lady Natasha is now married to Kate's former boyfriend, Finch. Lady Natasha has known Prince William since she was a little girl as their fathers are close friends. As you may know, the blue poppy is the national flower of Bhutan, making the dress a carefully considered choice for Kate. Kate completed her look with her chosen heels for the royal tour. Giant Vito Rossi's Sicily strappy sandals along with her engagement ring and delicate earrings. She was presented with a silk scarf at the ceremony, a finishing touch to an outfit styled for the spotlight. The reception celebrated Great Britain's relationship with Putin. Attendees included British nationals, living in the country and Bhutanese people with strong links to the UK. The pair traveled to India in 2010 where they spent time working in the slums of Delhi in an aftercare home for women who had been trafficked into the sex trade. They recognized the power employment had to transform their lives and set up Beulah London to support victims and raise awareness. Founded by Lady Natasha Rufus Isaacs and Lavinia Brennan. In 2011, the ethical fashion label aims to support the victims of sex trafficking in India. 10% of all profits from all their sales helps to fund the Beulah Trust, which was set up in 2013. The trust aims to give grants that pay for skill courses, giving women who have been victims of sex trafficking and abuse a chance to find work, generate an income, and live a self-sufficient life free from abuse. It's not the first time we've seen the princess in one of Beulah London's pieces. She was first spotted in the Red Sarai dress for the 100 Women in Hedge Funds Gala in October 2011, six months after her wedding to Prince William. During her visit to Family Action's Lewis and Bass in South London, the bespoke olive green midi dress by British label. Beulah London was much more than a cheap signature piece. There's also a touching story behind the brand. Princess Kate has stolen the show on several occasions, such as at the Top Gun Maverick premiere, and has worn garments from a host of designers including her favorites, Alexander McQueen and Jenny Packham. She kicked off the year by wowing in an on-trend camel ensemble when she and William visited the church on the street in Burnley. Kate Rue wore her Massimo Duty cashmere wool camel coat and paired it with an iris and ink ribbed coarse set. She also sported a pair of St. Laurent Jane 95 suede knee-high boots in February. She jetted off to Denmark, where she wore several incredible outfits, including a more budget-friendly jacket. As she was seen wearing a red-blue clay blazer from High Street favorite Zora, she paired the jacket with trousers, a bag, and shoes she'd previously worn along with a pair of 153-pound earrings. Williams's Caribbean tour in March was filled with incredible outfits, the princess opting for vibrant pattern dresses and casual beach attire for several different engagements. Kate arrived wearing a Jenny Packham blue lace dress, believed to be worth around 4,000 pounds, and her looks only got better from there. On day two, Kate wore a summer dress by Tony Birch in bright blue, which retails for 455 pounds, paired with Stuart Weissman's Paris. She finished off the look with Cezanne jewelry and Ryan Van glasses. 